Hi guys, welcome to a walk around of a three bed detached villa we've got just coming on here at La Turri Golf Resort. Um, we are in Calle Chanchetti, as always a lovely tree lined road here on La Torre. Um They're all lovely kept, they're all lovely maintained. Um, I've already been in here, done the images and we've also done the virtual 360 tour. Um, have a look at them because um, it will give you a, a good idea as well but I'd like to do these walk arounds now because it seems to be very popular and people like them. Um, I suppose it is about as close as you can get to being here as possible. This is a lovely villa, I've already walked all around it and I could spend 25 minutes doing this video but obviously I know that that's too long so I'm going to get around it um, as, soon as, I, as quickly as I can with as much info as I can. Um, this is being filmed in 4K so if you look at it as soon as it comes onto our channel, our YouTube channel, come back an hour later or so, um, it is well worth the wait to, to view in 4K. So you've got your off-street parking here. Um, is the first thing you note. Okay, so this is off street, but like you can see, there's lots and lots of parking on the road here as well. So there's never an issue with parking. So heading up to the entrance, front entrance. So the, again, first thing I note is they've actually added this, this little gate here. Um, the reason that a lot of people add these gates is obviously without it, people can actually just get access to your solarium, no problem. Um, so a lot of people have added these gates. Um, it just basically encloses the whole area. So that means nobody can actually get into to either to the front door of your house or upstairs to the solarium. We'll head to the solarium at the ends and we'll just stick to the house first and foremost. So as you walk through the front door, you come into this kind of hallway area here. Okay. So directly ahead is your master bedroom and to your right is a lovely big storage cupboard. Okay, so think of a, a big double wardrobe size. Um, that's what you've got in here. Okay, it stretches back there, but you've also got a locked door here, okay, and I've actually been through here, um, and that is actually bigger again than this here, so this goes all the way back, so it's a fantastic size. These guys have locked this because obviously it makes it a lockable storage cupboard, so for example, if you're renting this out or anything like that, it means you can put your stuff in here, no one has access, has access to it, so it's a great little bonus. So we'll start over here. So you've got the lovely dining area set up here. So this is like a, a rectangular kind of glass table and six chairs, very modern, very nice, very clean. And this is just, if you like, just by the window here, which again, just looks out to the front of the villa. So you're looking pretty much directly out to the, the off street parking here. Lovely and bright room, furnished really nicely. Now, I know these guys are taking a few bits with them, the TV being one of them. Um, and I think there's a dining set out here that they want to take as well. Um, but they have advised that anything they take, they will be replacing. Said so really nice, really clean, fantastic condition throughout. all very very nice ac unit up here don't forget everything with latori golf as well is gas central heating throughout that's every room and the bathrooms bathrooms have like towel heaters slash radiators in them as well prices is coming on at i believe it's two two nine five hundred okay so just shy of two hundred and thirty thousand euros that's fully kitted out, and it has a lovely surprise in the garden, which we'll go out and see shortly. So let's have a walk through the bedrooms to this side first and the other rooms. So again, you come to this kind of longish hallway area here. Directly to the left is one of the bedrooms. Now these villas, okay, this is the three bed, two bath, Arky style, A-R-C-E. And these by far have the biggest bedrooms of any villa on resort. So if you're looking something with great size bedrooms, these are, the ones okay a lot bigger than any other style and of course all on one level so no stairways so these guys obviously do a bit of work from home so they've just got their desk set up over here you've got a very nice wide wardrobe area over here again ac unit just up here you can see and the actual radiator here is just behind that desk there window as uh, the one, well, exactly the same as the one we uh, just looked at a moment ago, because we're literally at the side of it. So this looks out onto the entrance to the house and the, the road. Coming back out onto the hallway, next room we hit is one of the two bathrooms. Fantastic size. 
you know, really long, as you can see. Everything's been replaced here. That's not original. The actual mirror itself is certainly not original. This is where I think a B-Day would have been. They've taken that out to make it a more useful space. The toilet again has been replaced. That's not original. You've got your towel heater slash radiator here and a good sized shower over here. And the window, you know, I know a lot of people like windows in bathrooms, which it does have, but this is not a small shower. It's hard to see on these cameras, but that's actually a very good size. So you're not gonna feel claustrophobic in there. Okay, coming back out onto the long hallway, take a left. Next room we hear is the kitchen, which again is a fantastic size. Very usable, lots of workspace. Again, the only thing original in this kitchen is the actual cupboards themselves. All the worktop has been replaced to like a, a nice silestone. Um, the oven and the hob has all been replaced as well. Okay, so you've got your washing machine down here. And then as always with these villas, they have a completely separate utility. Window over here and utility just to our right. So as you can see, this is being used very well. Lots of stuff in here. It's a nice big utility room. Usually um, your washing machine, which is in here, would, you'd usually find that here and where the washing machine is a dishwasher. So these guys have not needed a dishwasher. There's not one in here. And they've replaced it with a fridge, probably a beer fridge, which of course is much more important. And of course, that's your combi boiler. Don't forget all of your hot water and central heating here is natural gas. It's piped in, no bottles. Great usable space, lots of worktop, lots of cupboards. Right, out of the kitchen, turn left, we go into the second bedroom. Again, first thing that hits you is great size. Again, large wardrobes over here, large built-in wardrobes. That is actually two single beds joined together, so that's kind of like the size of a Super King. Very wide, as hopefully you can see, and still lots and lots of space in here. So like I said before, these are by far the biggest bedrooms of any villa type on the resort. Again, you can see the AC unit up here and windows here looking out onto the garden and lovely pool, which we'll get to shortly. So radiator here, moving out. We're gonna go over to look at the master. So this is your dining area here, front doorway in here. This was the storage cupboard. So just as you walk in, the storage cupboard's to your right. And almost directly ahead is your master. So again, first thing you kind of notice is a nice long hallway leading up to the master. First door on your right, bathroom. Again, that's where the bidet would have been. They've changed that and made it a more usable space. Toilet, again, which is not the original, been replaced. Everything here has been replaced as well. And then you've got a full-size bath there with a glass screen. And not one window, but two. So certainly plenty of ventilation. Coming out, turning right into the master. Last time I have to say it, but again, fantastic size room. Again, AC unit up here, inbuilt wardrobes, and you can see your radiator just there. And view from this one straight out onto this amazing pool, which we'll look at shortly. So back up the long hallway, we're gonna hit outside now. So the first thing that I kind of got here was this great space here. So this is your terrace, right? This is your kind of terraced area leading off the lounge. A lot of people do close these in with various kind of things, whether it's a complete extension or whether it's glass. I actually really like what these guys have done. What they've done here is basically they have enclosed it, but they've enclosed it with just like a netting, like a mosquito netting, kind of similar to what you get, you know, in the Florida villas works really well, it's completely enclosed. It just means that you can sit out here all day, all night, not have any issues at all with any flies or anything like that. It's not an issue on here. I would never say it's an issue on here. It was Spain, so it's just the same as anywhere in Spain. Um, but it just means that you can sit out here as long as you like, all day, all night, and not have any issues at all with anything bothering you. Great dining table here. I, I, I believe this is one of the ones they do want to take with them. Um, but again, anything they take, they are replacing like for like. Not exactly the same, but what I mean is this will be another table and chairs replaced here. So, pretty much all fixed. 
apart from you can see doors here, sliding doors on your right, and there's a smaller door here on your left. So I'm gonna go out the left side. So you're straight out into your garden. As you can see, it's like a fake grass down on the floor, like an astro turf. It's all set up nicely with some beds here. Round to the sides, that is your access out from the utility room, from the kitchen. And then just runs to the side. As you can see, the actual villa is fenced all the way around. Okay, so anyone with small kids, small pets, anything like that, completely secure. And this pool, absolutely fantastic. This has got to be 10, possibly more meters long. It's all the way back here. And then also, as you can see, kind of like an L shape back here as well. So, I mean, just this space here has to be five meters. That's got to be 10 minimum. I mean, it's a fantastic size pool. This is a pool you could use. I mean, as in swimming, you can use this very, very nicely. Really nice. And then of course it goes back here. You can see it's fenced here as well. This is your pool house here. So this is where your pump and filter and things are. And this just leads out to the, the front of the house again. All the hedges and everything are done for you. You know, that's part of your community fee. Community fee here on this villa is 190 euros per month. Don't forget on Latori that actually includes your internet, which is now all fiber optic. Uh, 50 megabit speed as standard, so that's included. Uh, it also includes your international TV stations. And it also includes an internal phone line. So you can ring any property, you can ring any commercial property like booking golf or anything like that as well. That's all included. And here we go, has a lovely little bonus. You've also got a jacuzzi on this side of the pool. Okay, so you can sit on your steps there and just enjoy the jacuzzi. Fantastic. It's just a little button you press at the side of the pool to do that, fantastic. But it really is a fantastic size pool here. The garden is perfect. As you can see, the sun is directly on me. It's now 10 to two. I was here at half past four the day before yesterday and it was exactly the same. So you've pretty much got sun here all afternoon, certainly this time of year. Back through the house, through the enclosed kind of terrace area. We just want to quickly grab in the solarium before we finish. I can feel the phone getting very hot. So uh, I'll quickly try and get up these stairs before it says it's too hot. So this is the way in and up the stairs here to your solarium. So all of these have a fantastic solarium up top. And this is no exception. Again, they've put the kind of fake grass down. And what that does, especially in summer months, is just keeps you, you know, you can walk around in, in bare feet. You don't have to worry about getting burnt from the tiles. And lovely seating area up here. Really nice rattan set here. So your barbecue over here, kind of a storage thing just over here to your left. Nice big umbrella. Another storage thing over here, it's a couple more sun beds, and that's just your compressor units. But a lovely area up here. And of course, this is rooftop, right? So you're gonna get sun here all day and all night. Well, you're gonna get the sun out as long as it, you're gonna get the sun up here as long as it's out, uh, regardless of what time of year. The orientation of the garden, just so you know, is east. So that way is east and that way is south, which is why it's getting plenty of sun. If you actually look down, you can actually look down from here. You know, the whole garden is caked in sunshine. And like I said, I was here at 4.30 and it was exactly the same. It's a lovely villa, guys. Um, if you have any questions, do let us know. Um, this will be hitting the site, uh, hopefully tomorrow, latest. Um, any questions, um, let us know. Like I said, I believe it's coming on at 229500 the community fee is 190 per month and it's fully furnished fully air conditioned obviously gas central eating throughout as they all are lovely house let us know if you have any questions